today's gonna be a simple unboxing video and a brief catch up on life kind of video so if you're interested in watching and in unboxing with me stay tuned hey everybody my name is eliana from raising the bar for kids thank you so much for tuning in today Today I have some exciting things to share with you guys. As you can see, I have these two boxes that I have not opened yet. They came in the mail and I kind of know who they're from, but I don't really know what exactly is inside. So um, we're gonna be opening them up together today. A lot has happened these last few months. We are under a pandemic, um, COVID-19. And so there's been a lot of changes within our education system. Um, before the end of the last school year, we were already doing distance learning. So um, everything was pretty new to us because everything was all of a sudden that everything just kind of happened. And um, so it put a lot of us teachers in a really tough situation, not only teachers, but parents, families, students and um, administrators everybody really um it's been it's been really tough to really enjoy my summer because i've just been super anxious there's just so many unknowns there's things that i mean i want to plan but i don't know if i'm if i need to use uh certain resources because i don't know if we're going to be online or if we're not or if we're going to be in person there's just so many things that are still in question and so it makes a person like me, a planner, um, really anxious, um, nervous, and stressed. So uh, the past few weeks, I've really just been taking a break. I've been allowing my time to just spend with family, to spend it on things that really just bring joy and happiness to my life. Because you guys, like, anxiety is no joke. Stress is no joke. Um, just to get personal real quick, like, my health was just not good after spring break after march when everything just kind of started with covid19 it was just not good for me so i had to make a lot of lifestyle changes um which i'm proud of you know sometimes you get put under these situations to really just push you to the next level and that's the way i'm perceiving it as right because it's all about perspective so um like i said my health was just really bad um i lost a lot of weight and as you can see I can't afford to lose any more weight because I'm already skinny <laughs> but it was really bad um I had some family members who tested positive for COVID and so that didn't help at all um I wasn't eating my appetite was just not non-existent um I was also just doing a lot of translating not only for my school and for my teachers and for my students and families but for other schools within my district. Um it was just really really chaotic last at the end of the last school year. Um and then throw in just the pandemic and then you having to take care of yourself of your 2, your 3 year old, you you know like it's just so many things, right? So um I just committed myself to really taking the time to establish a routine where I could work out again, um, where I could just give myself some grace, some some uh, me time. And when I say me time, it's not like going shopping or going to get my nails done and all that stuff because, I mean, to some people that's self-care and that's okay. Um, but what I'm getting at is like, I wanted to really get to myself, to me. Like for a long time, I st I haven't worked out. Um, I used to be so active growing up, you know, I used to be in sports teams and I used to be just outside all the time, either running or playing a sport or swimming at the swimming pool. I was just always active. And so as you get older, you have all these responsibilities, right? Like you start working, um, you go to college and you have all these courses and then you know you just join different organizations and you're doing community service and you're doing all these other things except taking care of yourself and so um i'm a lover i'm a giver but i really had to check back in with myself this summer 
especially after I lost all that weight and at, a, at an alarming rate too. Um, I really had to like just check in with myself and really like prioritize my health. Um, because if I don't take care of myself, seriously, who will? You know, especially now through this pandemic, like I needed to make sure I was literally just building my immune system, taking care of myself, um, not getting stressed because that also messes with your immune system. There's just so many things that just forced me into this place. And so I'm here, right? So I'm not perfect or, you know, I try not to be either, but I, I definitely tell my kids progress over perfection. And that's exactly what I established this summer. I progressed in my personal life because now I've established a routine where I'm dedicating 20, 25, 30 minutes of my day to just either meditate, to um, make myself a protein plant-based smoothie, or um, just doing a lot of more home-cooked meals, spending time with my family, putting the phone down, not having to necessarily post on my blog or my social media platforms every day to try to keep up with numbers and engagement. Like, I literally have been just so much happier, you guys. Like, I don't know. It's just been a different me lately. And um, everybody around me has been kind of sensing it too. Um, my mood has been better <laughs> because whew, when I'm stressed, I just turn into a different person. But um, I say all that to just remind you guys that yes, we're teachers. Yes, we're parents. Yes, we're educators. Yes, we have all these hats that we wear, right? But what's going to happen when you don't have health? You know what I mean? What's going to happen when you can't be productive because you just can't get up or mentally you're just, you don't have the headspace or you're replying to all these emails, but you're sounding like you're in a really bad negative space. You know, what kind of atmosphere do I want for myself, for my kids, for my family, for my students? You know, so I had to really check in with myself and reflect and meditate because I've been doing a lot of that. Um, do some yoga to just kind of get back in tune with my body. Um, I've been eating better. I actually gained a couple pounds, so yay me. <laughs> and, um, and I've been focusing on the things that really bring me joy. Take time to reflect on the things that make you truly happy. And I'm not talking about like shopping and doing all that stuff because that, that makes me happy too. But like get in tune with your body, get in tune with your soul, with your mind, because you guys like teacher burnout, mommy burnout, burnout period is real. All right. So I got my little handy scissors to help me cut open these boxes. So this was shipped to me from Dixon Ticonderoga Company. And um, let me give you a little backstory real quick as I open the box. Um, so I was on Instagram and I saw that there was a giveaway, right? Like there's tons of giveaways um, on Instagram from just different companies and things of that nature. And I mean, I enter giveaways here and there, but I try not to because I always feel like I never win. <laughs> I never win raffles. Like, I don't know what is up with my luck. I never win giveaways. So I was like, you know what? Like I saw a teacher friend repost it um, on her Instagram. And then I was like, okay, well, let me just see what this is about. Cause it was a cute little giveaway. So um, I was like, okay, let me click on it. And then obviously I followed the directions. I followed the page, left my comment or whatever the case might be. You know, they have their little stipulations. And then I was like, okay, whatever. So. I just kept on scrolling, doing my thing on Instagram. Like, I didn't really think I was going to win. But a couple of days after that, maybe a week later or two, I got a, a private, a, a direct message on Instagram from the company, um, Ticonderoga. And I'm like, okay, like, this is random. And then they hit me up and they're like, congratulations, you won the raffle, you won the giveaway. I was like, wait a minute, what? Like... Seriously? <laughs> so, 
enter giveaways because you never know. Like, I honestly was not ever sure if I was ever going to win. And here I am, right? They had announced what this is. So I know what this is. And I'm super excited to share what this is with you guys. But I'm not sure what's in here because they told me in the, in the message, hey, just to let you know, you're also going to be getting some extra goodies from us. And I'm like, oh, okay. Thanks, sis. Like, oh. <laughs> so I was so excited um, to get that message. And um, yeah, so when the boxes actually arrived, oh my God, me and my son did a happy dance times, I don't know how many times that day. So he was so excited. He thought the presents were for him because let's be honest, lately, he just gets everything. Um, mommy doesn't buy anything for herself anymore. So <laughs> whenever he sees packages and I'm like, yay, it's a present. He thinks it's automatically for him. Yeah, mom life. But anyway, this is for me, for mama. And he wanted to come and open the presents with me. And I'm like, no, this is mommy's moment. This is mommy's time. <laughs> so let's open it together. I'm so excited, you guys. I don't even want to peek yet. But Ticonderoga, um, I don't know if you guys have ever seen their pencils. Like I, they have different products, of course, but they are like number one on pencils. And so I was super, oh, I was super excited when I saw this giveaway, you guys. Okay, so I'm going to just start with the basics in here. So I got my pack of Ticonderoga the world's best pencils i got them pre-sharpened as you can see and uh it's a pack of 18. they're premium wood latex free eraser like this is crazy they've been around for over a hundred years and i believe it because i mean i'm not a hundred years old but as a little girl i remember that these pencils always stood out to me because they always had like the green shiny metal part. Like they're just very unique to themselves. And they have like the green. Oh, I don't even want to open it. They have like just the green um, text here. So I mean, they're number two pencils. And they probably, you know, like there's plenty of number two pencils out there. But they were always super unique to me. But you guys, just like holding the pencil, I'm sorry. I don't know if I just sound biased, but these pencils are legit. I'm excited. Got my little pack of pencils. Then they also sent me these beautiful neon colored pencils. They're still number two pencils. They're just different colors. So you have pink, orange, blue, yellow, and green. And these are also premium wood latex free erasers. Um, I love them. They're so pretty. Oh, these are so pretty. Right, let me just show you guys. Look at how pretty they are. And so each color of the pencil matches the eraser. Oh, I'm so happy. Like, these are like the simple things that make me happy. I remember like as a little girl, I would always love going back to school shopping. Like notebooks, pencils, markers, folders, going shopping for those things, for those things literally just forget the toy store, forget the toy aisle. Like I'm in the school supply aisle. Oh, look at this. I thought they were like mini pencils, you guys. These are erasers. They're neon erasers. They're neon colored. So these are also like the pencils, non-toxic and latex free erasers. This is so cool. It says exceptional quality for smudge free corrections. Oh, you guys. And they come in this fun pencil shape. Like this is so cute. So cute. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. And then they also sent me these, the Ticonderoga style erasers, they're in the regular, you know, classic colors. These are so cute. It says the world's best eraser. That's a bold statement, you guys. But I've used these pencils and this brand before. And let me tell you, there's just something unique about them. They're very premium quality. And there's just something unique about them, seriously. 
but I'm so excited. So that was that box. Oh, that is so cute. I'm so excited. I got me some new pencils and some new erasers. Like I'm excited to share these with my kiddos. Some of these. I won't be sharing all of them, but I'll share some. <laughs> so here you are. That's the first box. Um, so now let's move on to the big box. And so I, like I said, I know what's in here, but you guys don't. So that's the exciting part. And so this is what they were actually announcing in the giveaway. And when I saw it, I was like, oh my God, I really, really want this. I, I need it. I, you know, like as a teacher, you, you feel like you need everything. And you really don't. But this right here, oh my God, I just peeked at it. I needed this, you guys. Like, if you guys know me, I have a pretty vibrant, positive classroom. I'm a fun teacher. I'm like super enthusiastic about teaching and learning. I'm just having a positive, safe place for my kiddos. And this right here is about to literally just, they're, they're about to go crazy when they see this in my classroom. Are y'all ready? <laughs> I'll give you a little hint. I'll give you a little peek. Let me see, because I'm a shorty. Okay. Okay, like, come on, Ellie, get it together. All right, I'll give you a hint. Ready? Dixon Ticonderoga uh, number two pencil and it's just super huge like you guys I'm so excited I can't believe I actually won this it actually has like a little pencil tip right here <laughs> oh my god wait let me check the pencil did I break it Please, I just got it. I don't want to break it. Okay, I was about to really be like, okay, guys, Miss Salas is going to be using her pencil today and just start writing in front of them with this big pencil. <laughs> Can you imagine? They'll look at me like, oh my God, this is the coolest thing. But it's still the coolest thing. Like, you guys. Here, I can actually still... I have to take it out. Like, I'm sorry. I was going to wait, but I can always put it back, right? Right? Okay, let me be careful. Oh, this is so cute. You guys. Seriously, this is the cutest thing ever. Look at that. Let me get it closer for you guys. It's so beautiful. I'm like so, so excited, you guys. And it looks just like the regular pencils. Like, this is the cutest thing ever. Thank you, thank you, thank you to the Dixon Ticonderoga brand. I'm so happy to have entered your giveaway, seriously. And now all of my followers and all of my viewers are gonna know about you guys because this is just simply amazing. I love it. So that actually wraps up my video. I hope you guys enjoyed unboxing like with me. Um, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I, um, I update my channel with all kinds of stuff. I do some lifestyle stuff, family vlogs, teacher vlogs, classroom setups, um, read alouds. And then I also talk about mommy stuff things of that nature. So anything relating to just raising the bar for yourself and for your kiddos, that's me. I'm your girl. So make sure you subscribe. 
Uh, stay tuned for some more videos. Go follow my Instagram page at Raising the Bar for Kids. And let's stay connected, you guys. Um, until next time. And thank you for tuning in. Peace. <laughs>